guys, uh, good morning. Uh, this is a beautiful Sunday morning and I'm heading out uh, for the BMW ride to a breakfast place. So I thought uh, I'll go ahead and uh, uh, record everything what I'm doing. Uh, I decided to go with uh, this ride because uh, the last time I just went on my own and I thought huh, I've mastered some skills here so so let me uh, go for a ride and uh, see how it shapes up in a group ride and also I've been wanting to go with the BMW guys for a while now so I thought let me just uh, combine these two and then go for it uh, yep uh, all good weather has been beautiful it's gonna be hot uh, but uh, the ride is not that far, so it's going to be, I think, uh, not too bad. And uh, yeah, so what you're going to hear is uh, my navigation directions coming through, I think. So what I have is I have my Senna 10C and today I also have my uh, GitHub camera so I'm just gonna connect this a little bit uh, record from both these devices and uh, see how it goes uh, the uh, Senna is going to be just the starting part I think and what I'm going to do is uh, switch to the GitHub because the Senna I can easily switch on and switch off but the GitHub is a bit of a hassle you know I can't figure out whether it's on or off <laughs> So I just uh, leave it on once I start it. So that's where we are. Uh, ah, there's uh, one of my other group ride people. I think that's Rick Johnson, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, we will see. I think he's got a bagger. So that looks like a bagger. Yes, uh, that's what I've been doing, I'm chilling out. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys saw my previous video, I took this bike for the service. So um, we are all set uh, with the first service. And that means I can uh, rev up the engine as much as I can, or as, as much as I want to. So that's good, now that I'm going to be doing that. Oh, somebody went into the barrier here. So, uh, yeah, so it's going to be fun. Uh, yesterday I was out of town. I thought I might not go for this ride, but then I just came back and I said, uh, well, let me just uh, go for this ride. And the other uh, group also had a ride this morning, so I was kind of debating <laughs> which ride to go for. But then I finally decided that this one gives me a couple of hours more sleep. So I just picked this one up. Uh, so that's where we are. I will uh, talk to you guys in a bit uh, once I get to the place. Bye. Okay, we're getting close to uh, the meeting point, which is a racetrack on the intersection of Airport Road and 380. You know, there's a big, been a big talk about this 380 getting converted into a freeway between McKinney and Prosper. You know, uh, <laughs> it's a big, big uh, issue with all these towns. So the good thing is, uh, if they convert it into a freeway, then everybody can go back and forth without any traffic uh, hassles. But uh, the problem is, all of us who are living on on this road. <laughs> Uh, we're going to have a freeway in front of our houses and some of the land which they're trying to get is going through some people's existing houses so it's been a big issue <laughs> so hopefully it won't because they're building a bypass north of here anyway so I'm not sure why they need to convert this also into a freeway anyway that's the story of 380 the study is going on now construction will start 5 to 10 years from now 
Uh, it's a long way there. But uh, yeah, so this is the uh, east of McKinney. This is a racetrack where we normally meet. And then we'll probably head out from here. So I see that uh, it says in 0.9 miles we should arrive at our destination. Uh, 8 03 a.m., right about time. The guys want us to be here 15 minutes before, and the departure time is the KSU is 8:30. <laughs> KSU. That's a story to it. I didn't know what the heck KSU was. Kick stand up, I believe. <laughs> it took me six, three months to figure that one out. But uh, anyway, joys of motorcycle. You're learning everything. Constantly learning. Okay, I think I see those bikes there. So let's head on over. <laughs> Hello, sir. Okay. Hello, good morning. Junaid, I'm Street Watson. Nice to meet you. <laughs> so, what do you ride? <laughs> Oh, cool. That's the, uh, I like that color. Yeah, stands out. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Hello, sir. How are you? Good to see you. Congratulations on your new bike. New bike, yeah. Oh, awesome. Holy cow. You got some equipment. <laughs> yeah. If that all goes off at once, you'll be electrocuted. I know. <laughs> uh, yeah. Do you like this? Yeah. This is the 10C, actually. What is it? 10C. Uh, so it records, too. It's got a camera on it. The center 10C. It's brand? Sinner. Sinner, yeah. 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 Lost riding season. <laughs> yeah. The, uh, we're going to do an hour and a half run up to Aubrey. Uh, get moving, get some air in our faces. Rode the ride Tuesday. Didn't, we've all been on these roads. There's nothing special. Didn't see any wash drops. Roads in pretty good shape coming out of the winter with all the rain. Uh, so we turned south of Tioga. We couldn't climb it. I am freaking amazed at how much water is in that lake. Okay, we are set here uh, riding with uh, Austin in the group. It's going to be fun. There's a, a lot of bikes. Initially, there weren't too many, but uh, people are just showing up. There's Todd leading the other group. Uh, I think Colin following for him. I assume there's the fast group. <laughs> then we have uh, Austin leading our group here and uh, Craig doing the sweep. It's gonna be fun. There's a lot of GSs now, GSAs now coming up. It wasn't like that before. A lot more people getting GS and GSAs. Hopefully they will uh, start the off-roading part of it too.
eventually, I guess. It's a beautiful day to ride the bike. <laughs> uh, it's a little warm, but once you start moving, it's just gorgeous. Uh, if I open the visor, it's nice and comfortable. But then uh, last time I'd opened the visor and kept it all the way that way, and I saw bugs on my winch, uh, the visor. <laughs> so I'm thinking maybe. Uh, keep it closed, but if it gets warm enough, we'll probably just open it up. Okay guys, uh, enjoy the ride. Heading to New Hope Road, as uh, uh, you probably know in here, the uh, uh, navigation system on this. Now I'm recording in the uh, gear up camera on the, left, on the right hand side, so, which is good. Oh, this grooved payment <laughs> on my adventure bike. Adventure tires, uh, it was wandering all over the place. You know what? It actually wanders here too, so it's not too bad then. I just need to go slow. stuff but you know you gotta regulate your pace all the time based on the other people so that's a bit of a hassle <laughs> I feel but uh, that's part of the ride though gear further so you can really accelerate through and I gotta lean much more see the thing is that's what I gotta learn. lean much more so you have more confidence in actually powering it
I'm pretty impressed. Yeah, you can keep up with the guys. It's just whether you want to do it or not. So. It is not that bad. 50 mile an hour. Drop down and then let it drop. That's what they want to do. Everybody wants to go. Beautiful ranch here. Oh, look at the bales of hay. Jim Cannon Road. What a beautiful road here. This is the joy of motorcycling. Not those fast roads, it's the slow roads. You can go fast, but I can go where I want. I can go everywhere. That's the slogan. It is gorgeous. Yep, yep, yep. Jim Cannon, you're the master. <laughs> You're the man. I'm picking up this beauty. Funny, the speed limit shows 75, and he doesn't know what it is. He just puts it at the maximum speed limit. <laughs> that is interesting software decision. choice buddy
Okay. Can you go see? Yes. We'll get together, okay? Yeah, okay. sure. <laughs> Okay, now we have uh, Todd in front of me, Graham and Craig. We are the only people heading back in the actual route. So it's going to be fun. Okay, that was a fun ride. Fun uh, breakfast. I had a regular waffle and some hash browns. And the interesting thing was uh, there was a pecan flavored coffee, which was really good. Heading back now. That was a good get together. Good to chat with uh, uh, all the guys. These guys are fast riders, so I'm not sure I can keep up with these guys, but I probably won't even attempt. Riding here, which is good. I'm still working out the basics <laughs> how to shift your body weight, both front, top, and bottom. Ah, it's beautiful again, wide open spaces. Uh, that was a good trip. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. We will talk to you later then.